Hey everybody, how's it going? Stan the man here. I hope everybody's having a wonderful, wonderful day and welcome to another episode of Downland Farm. Um, uh, straight away guys, I want to say something. First, I want to thank you for everybody for all the support. I mean, it was a blast the past few weeks. I mean, my channel growed from 400 subs to, I don't know, uh, maybe a thousand thousand two hundred in week week and a half i mean guys that's amazing so if most of you guys don't know i'm doing a giveaway the link is in the description um i'm giving away a streaming microphone which i'm using right now and i did a review the video can be found somewhere in my channel i don't know i'm not sure where exactly um, it's uh, the BM300, it's one of the, let's say, most suitable starter microphones, it's under 30 bucks, it's come with pre-made sound card on 5 volts, so the only thing you need to do is just hook it up to a 5 volt power supply, either from the USB from the PC, which I personally um as a tip don't do it because you're gonna get static sound use a charger 5 volt charger yeah that should remove all the static electricity and then plug it to pc and you're ready to go uh i'm giving away uh hello you need first to unfold of course then first you need to unfold um next thing i'm giving away two gaming mouses and one gaming keyboard like i said guys the link is in the description you can find it uh i think more than 70 people have joined already which for me personally that's whoa you cut me off guard there really guys you really cut me off surprise so yeah and row have fun and i hope you have luck now let's check this out um, one thing you can notice is on the upper right corner is the money uh, to be fair guys um, why let me say why I started this playthrough um, first there were a bunch a bunch of you guys which actually wanted me to do some more farming sim videos except time lapses so I thought to myself why not I mean, to be honest, uh, to play farming sim it's fun, but I'm very cautious not to play too much because it's just gonna get frustrated because you're playing only the same game and if you play the same game every day, all day, making videos about it, there's gonna be... Uh, there's gonna get that time where you just get frustrated with the game, so... Uh, that's why I decided to start making this video just to bring some more changes to the channel because if you take a look back you only you can find live streams time lapses and some different uh, videos um, oh of course I was going to, uh, <laughs> I forgot uh, I started a brand new city skyline playthrough videos if you guys enjoy me making those don't forget to smash that like button leave a comment so I can know and I can make more and more videos so let's go back to farming sim uh, this I think is the fifth episode I think yeah it's the fifth episode of downland farm and I took a look at some other people played through videos from Daggerwind, Fridgar and I don't see them struggling too much you know why because they just use the cheat money cheat and they just have a bunch of money so at least they are freely to buy whatever they want to do whatever they want and that's the thing what I'm gonna do because I started this playthrough just to be more freely to talk about stuff with you guys so that's why I just gonna use it for this particular playthrough on the west coast um, right now I'm good uh i will definitely see if i'm gonna start using the money cheat but 
As we know guys, I really wanted to use only old equipment at that particular map. I think that's gonna be cool. Um, and actually right after I finish this episode, I'm gonna record uh, a West Coast. So I'm looking forward to it. So for this episode guys, uh, I really wanna talk about the new farming sim update. Cause I'm not sure if you guys know, but I think it's called Platinum Edition and let me bring up my stats real quickly it's called platinum edition and <coughs> hello let me quickly change the ai let's help him out come on guys we have to help the AI once in a while and also we have to grab a bailer we have to grab a bailer is that gonna work for you baby boo let's check that out Yep, that's perfect. Right. So yeah, it's called Platinum Edition. Let's see. Platinum Edition. Mm -hmm. I just want to bring some info, guys, so I can read it for you. Let's see. I'm reading this from the official farming sim site. So it's going to cost... 20 bucks and it contains one new South American game environment and new vehicles and tools from Case, Stara, TT, FMZ, Gangster Industries and much more. The included languages are English, French, Italian, German, Spanish, Portuguese, Dutch, Turkish, Polish, Czech, Hungarian, Russian, Romanian, a bunch of languages. I mean, come on, you understand. The release date is 14th of November. 2017 so it's under a month until that DLC comes up um, this DLC is compatible with the Windows version including Steam and on Mac uh, but you have to have update 1.5 or higher and as I'm looking through these vehicles over here uh, one thing that's kind uh, catching my eye is the fertilized spreader or sprayer the fertilized sprayer it's manufactured by stara and it's the imperator 3.0 <laughs> oh man uh fmz harvesters which i think this should be a new harvester but is it for sugar beets or i don't know but then we have the sugarcane harvesting it's case IH. It's looking pretty, pretty good. Also, we have a bunch of other sugarcane harvesters. I will include the picture, probably what I'm speaking. Uh, I'm gonna put them so you guys can see. Uh, one of the other thing really is uh, they really, really put uh, some work towards the sugarcane harvesting because I can see a bunch of tippers, um, a bunch of cedars. Uh, which can plant and harvest sugarcane and I think actually that's gonna look awesome uh, let me see can I bring something about the map uh, hmm not at this moment hmm they should implement more I think hmm strange oh let's see if the AI is actually gonna turn around without any problems let's see come on you can do it Come on. Yep, 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 yep. There you go. There you go. <clears throat> right. So, uh, about the DLC, of course, you can harvest a bunch of crops, including some far soybeans and new sugarcane you can transport your goods with trucks and trailers and try out the newly added drivable trains uh, also this time there is included B Braham cattle I think that's gonna look awesome and also there's in total there are gonna be more than 280 reproduced farming vehicles and tools from over 80 manufacturers so come on guys isn't that awesome 
I think that's gonna look amazing. And looking at the cows there, look like the South American cows, by the way. Hmm. Yep. Very, very awesome. Right, you know what? Let's leave the AI working. Uh, by the way, oh, you're almost full. Wow, okay, let's quickly go and grab a tractor. Let's. We're not gonna use a Miss Ferguson because you are not that strong. So, where is my tipper? It's over here. We need to buy a bigger one. Hello, cows, how are you today? Yellow. Right. <clears throat> okay, let's grab a U. I haven't used this challenger too much. That's why I bought it because I haven't used it that much. And some of you guys are asking me about using the challenger, so there we go. Come on. <laughs> the wheel is pretty strange, though. Look at this. Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> right. Let's quickly go and grab a tipper and I'll be back in just a sec. Uh, <laughs> I almost hit that car. Stan, you should be... Look at this. You should be driving on the left side, Stan. <laughs> Every time I forget. Right. One thing I uh, forgot to mention is the Platinum Edition DLC, the new South American DLC doesn't require you to have the other DLCs for example you don't need the big butt you don't need the Kun DLC to play this one I just want to get it out there because some I know some of you guys gonna be but Stan what's gonna happen if I um, don't have the other DLC but there you go you don't need to have the other two three DLCs to have the South American one, so you can sleep without a problem. Now, let's go and empty the harvester. And you know what? I'm then I'm gonna go and grab a brand new uh, food mixer because this one is just so small, we barely can do anything. But I'm not gonna grab a stationary one because we already used that one too much I mean come on guys we're using that in every playthrough of farming sim actually I'm gonna use the mobile one and I think that's actually gonna be very very awesome and look at how the AI did a wonderful job wow using this big harvester makes this field look very very small come on empty out yep 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 Nice job, nice job. Are you gonna be good? I think so. So we might leave you go like so. Mm -hmm. Let's wait a little bit. Let's just admire. Look at this, how big this is. Like, we're gonna be done in no time. Right, let's leave this. Come on. So, uh, let's grab a you. Also, how is the cows? How are the cows? We don't have any loans as you can see, which is amazing. Uh, let's check. They need some straw. No, 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 no. They're good. Okay, we actually can go and get rid of this. Whew, finally. I have to look at... Whoa. I have to look at some more animal mods. I know they're out there. I just I just don't have the time to, to do so. And I know a bunch of you guys are asking for different links and everything. To be honest, I lost them. I lost every single link to every single mod I have from the past summer. But at least for the past few months, to be honest. And right now... I'm actually scared to post links because I don't want to get in trouble from the actual developers of the mods. I don't want to put links where actually the link is to a stolen mod. So you just guys can ask me for the name of the mod. I can tell you the name of the mod in the comments. And you can look for it yourself on your own risk. I just don't want to get in trouble. Right, let's sell you. Oh, we can customize you? Really? No, that ain't true. 
I don't think we can customize this. Probably we can change the color. Uh, can we open this? Hello? Hello? Nobody can open? Fine. Huh. And we are inside. Boop. Let's see. Animals, where are you? Uh, no, we cannot uh, customize it. I knew it. Okay. This one, 168 grand. We will take it. We will take it. Should we get the bell shredder? I think I have a very cool... Yeah. This machine can take bells and use them to cover the ground of cow with straw. One bell. And this is for two bells. <laughs> Alright. Uh, a forage mixer wagon blends silage hang straw into a total mixing ratio. Uh, hmm. I might use this one uh, at least for the straw. At least for the straw, maybe we can grab you. Yeah, why not? Let's just do it. Let's just do it. I mean, I know we already have it pre-bought uh, pre when you start to play downland. Wow, that was an awful sentence. Let me try this again. So, you get a bell shredder when you first start your game. So when you load up the game for the first time i'm gonna say it again <laughs> when you load up the game for the first time on the downland farm you get a bunch of goody goodies Whoa, ho, ho, ho. drive on the left side stand so you get three tractors you get some weights actually the tractors are blue which for me that's color is hideous that tone of blue is hideous. Um, also, you get a bell shredder, but I think it's the small one. I haven't took a look. You get also another good stuff like a grass mower. Also, no, it's actually a grass curl. Look at this. <laughs> Isn't that awesome? I love it. Um, you get a tipper loading wagon. Actually, the wooden wagon is one of the um, most expensive ones. Alrighty, let's turn around and park you inside. Let's go like so. Let's try. Is this gonna fit? It's actually barely fitting. Okay. Nice. So it's 64 capacity. Let's see. Let's see. So 64 capacity means that. Uh, hmm, we can use four bales for, is it four? Yeah, we can use four bales for the power foot, let's see, let's see, so that's 32, so four, two, and two, is it, how much is it, I, I really don't forget, so 64, hmm, let's add, really let's add four bales of this so that's three bales and we need to put one more let's see so here are three bales and let's see so here is the fourth one we need to grab two silage bales and two straw bales to be precise hmm Let's check that out. Let's back you up over here, like so. Come on, go down. Uh, go down. Let's see, is this actually the correct ratio? So, how we have 24 liters of capacity. Here are the bells, silage bells and straw bells let's grab two of them oh wow this is hideous over here i forgot to remove it let's see garage uh, garage where is it light post treat lamp you 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 poop be gone yes thank you very much <laughs> thank you very much then we got 500 euros for it not bad not bad uh, so there you go, two bales of straw. Let's see. Is how much is that gonna be? Forty-eight thousand liters, I think.
that's 32 so actually it needs eight bales of silage and four bales of straw and no eight bales of hay and uh, oh wow hello <laughs> hello uh, I may have to buy a bigger weight <laughs> this barely can fit anymore okay oh boy let's be careful let's be careful so let's say that again we need eight bales of uh, hay four bales of silage and four bales of straw to make 64 thousand liters of power food yep it changed color even wow so one other thing is stan you need to buy a bigger weight for the macy ferguson otherwise the weight of the bells are gonna flip it over that's something i will definitely look at all right let's grab a u and this is the last time we the we do uh, power food so we should be good oh boy yeah i really need to grab a bigger weight all right let's see is that gonna be enough is that 64 yes it is okay awesome now let's quickly jump on the other tractor uh also let me actually go like so mm -hmm. hey man how are you doing you're actually doing a wonderful wonderful job not bad not bad that's thirty thousand liters of wheat uh, wheat let's go and load it yep i'm actually pretty pretty pleased of what the ai has done look at this hmm, which makes me think of i might have to buy a bigger header for the macy ferguson i'm using at the west coast because right now it just takes ages for that combine to go around and where was the <laughs> where is the tipper where was I can unload the crops over here. I forgot. Whoa. I really don't remember. Where was it? Where was it? So it's not over here. Hello? Hello? No way. <laughs> I don't remember really where was the place where I can put the crops. Hey, hey cows, how are you? Hey cows, cows. Right, let's check this building over here. Hello. Oh, chiquiones. No, we don't need the chiquiones. Uh, it's not over here. It's definitely not here. Oh boy. Did I really forget where I can store this? We need the barn, by the way. Um. so this is a barn that's perfect yeah what is this wow okay can you hear this what is this wow i don't know but this uh, it's awful okay huh. um rng newbie agricultural construction it's not what we are looking for is it i don't think so no <laughs> oh boy uh these are the sheep these are the pigs wow i really don't remember downland sawmill spinnery living yard downland uh -huh -huh. yorkshire sugar store oh we have one more let's visit you you're again a barn yo what up <laughs> oh boy you know what guys <laughs> let's leave this for the next episode we will look where we can actually store the crop because <laughs> this thing is ridiculous thanks again guys for whoever who joined me during this episode you guys are awesome don't forget to smash that like button leave a comment and subscribe for more stand the man over and out